Alrighty. Quieter came in and Veli left. Oh, Quieter, put on Veli's gear too. When when Quieter's, as soon as we're done having the funeral for for Veli, Quieter's going to uh, to steal all his stuff. Coyote's having a sad wander. Yeah, that's because I had to go over to the corpses. That's that's fine. Plus five mood buff, and then a little bit of uh, the social points. Quieter here, quieter, quieter. Just you put this on. Force wheel all their stuff. Or force wield? Force equip. I don't know. You don't really wield gear. You would wield like a knife, but not a not a helmet. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe that, that word does work. And shield, have you tended to this at all while you were home? No. Shield's still been incredibly busy, even with quieter helping out. Quieter was sick when they showed up, though. They haven't been helping out like that much. And I want to give them um, my drug policy 5 as well. Everyone gets drug policy 5. Except the baby. You, no drugs. Oh, and yeah, let's go. They're, they're, the baby's getting taught again. This is so cool. Oh, and we've been playing RimWorld for about an hour. Just like yesterday, these so this, these RimWorld sections of the stream are flying by. But yes, we've been playing for about an hour, so if you're enjoying the content, it would mean a lot to me if you would follow. I can see your name up here in the top left. So everyone will be able to see your name, and I can thank you personally. But that's um, So we're going good. We're doing pretty well here. I, I want to start building this. Did I ever get some components? Did I cancel the mining order? Oh, they're just all the way out here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, and I'll put the deconstruction order back in on these ships because I'm just like, I'm kind of desperate for components. Um, hmm. Where is the fabrication? Yeah, this is where you make components. I'm pretty far away from doing that. So I'm just going to be kind of component poor for a while. I'll do my best to buy them off traders if they show up, but that's not always a guarantee. We have so much cloth. I don't want to keep growing this field. Um, don't allow sewing. After after this, this field is pulled. I don't want more cloth. I'll do my best to sell the cloth. Um, when Again, when traders come by. This hay is good now. Yeah, it's frozen. It won't spoil. Lovely. Lovely to see it. We had our first burial... It's coyotes. Yeah, you're done with your sad wandering. I could have another party pretty soon, I'm pretty sure. Um, I never built those kneel sheets, though, and I have the cloth for it now, so I'll build some uh, kneel sheets so my people are happier with their with their parties. Where is it? Kneel? Kneel sheet? Okay, here we go. I'll do the sheets. Um, they take a little more, but that's fine. I'll just do them here. That looks fine, I guess. Not really. It kind of looks ugly, but that I'm going to leave it there anyways. Young beggars need a need aid. Poor children are begging for thirty-five herbal medicine. Um, well, I'm not gonna like capture them. How much herbal medicine? I have over a hundred. I'll just give it to them. I don't know. I know if you give people like if you do perform uh, charity, I think sometimes they'll come back and give you a gift. I don't know if kids will come back and give you a gift. Um, this is maybe just actual charity, and I'm gonna get nothing out of it, but that's fine. On my next social update, I might make my people uh, require charity. I've been I've been doing it pretty often, so I, I'd be okay with my people uh, enjoy getting the the mood buff out of it. When he's on talk to Farley, why can't I? Yeah, someone, 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 give these kids the medicine they're here for. I guess the the little the little pawn was too small. I just couldn't click on him. I was just missing. Okay, so we lost a colonist, but that's no big deal. And I'm just going to run to the restroom. So as usual, I'm going to turn my mic off and I'll leave the game playing, though.
I'm back. No one died while I was gone, so that's good. Turn this back up to full speed. And then Oni song. Did you just... I'm going to check if they have a mood debuff. Did they see the dead people? Um, it looks like no. It looks like... Oh, Happy Youngsters just gives you a, a, a mood buff. Let's go. Um, but yeah, so it looks like... A, oh, they want a nice bedroom, even though they want the slab bedroom. I didn't realize that. It looks like this wall is good enough to block them from seeing the corpses. So it looks weird, but that's fine. <laughs> Not everything can be perfectly cubed. Like this room looks weird. Oh, and I was going to have a party. Let's party. Yeah, expected quality 100%. I'm, I'm stacking the, all the, the deep, all the buffs up. Oh, little, little cherry comes by. My little baby comes and hangs out. And they're age four now. They're not age three anymore. Growth tier. Okay. I didn't even notice that. Cool, cool. Terrible. Oh, that's not great. That's okay. That happens sometimes. I did, I did what I could. I, I gave them all the opportunity to have a nice party, and they still had a boring party, so... Nothing I can do about it. And then we'll slowly get all this wood brought in. Quieter. You're praying. That's fine, quieter. How much plant work have you been doing, though? Um, um, it, it looks like not much. Like, what are you doing instead of doing plant work all the time? Oh, I have you constructing as well. That That's it. No, so stop doing that. Quieter is just going to be always cutting, cutting, or preparing the, the fields and stuff. Um, if I need them to switch back and do some construction for, like, an emergency project, I can. But I want to get these, and I'm up to 13. 13 components. That's a good amount. So I'll make the the subcore encoder and put it in here. And I think that when I last was working on um, interacting with my people, or my robots, smithing was the stat that was used uh, to, to control them or to make them. So I'll, I'll, I'll use smithing again. Or I'll, I'll raise, excuse me, I'll raise priorities on Coyote to allow for smithing, um, such that when this is made and I have bills in here, they will do it straight away. And we, that was just like a rolling brownout. That was just all the power flicking on and off because we were we didn't have quite enough in the batteries to make it through the night. With the, the one generator, it looks like we can, this is pretty good though. We can make it through most of the night and there's just a touch of time where we're r desperate for power. We're a little low. This donkey, one of them, yeah, she was pregnant a long time ago. So she's, she'll, the baby should be coming soon. There's a way you can see how long it takes for the, the babies to, um, for the pregnancy to, to happen. Gestation time, six days, almost seven days, and then another 20 before they become an adult. So eventually they'll have more donkeys. Imperial ship crash. Okay, these are like, they're like emergencies. Um, expires in 14 hours you can't decide um there's a, a ship from the the empire is crashing and they want to crash on your land did i ever make i don't think i ever made uh shield a um i never did his quest to become a yeah an acolyte oh because i never got a throne going duh this is i this is all i need to get this taken care of um so let me go back to that quest where is it Okay, Imperial Ship Crash. So this is charity? I didn't know this was charity as well. Um, I didn't know letting them land here would be charity. So they have four cataphracts defending them. But it's, there's going to be a an attack from the, uh, the trash toxers. I want the honor, though. I'll just, I'll just take it. And I'll put it on shield. This shouldn't be enough. I'll double check. I don't want shield, as mentioned. I don't want them to miss in a, a ceremony. So to go from Yaomin Yao Min to Acolyte, it's going to eat six of their honor, and they have ten. They'll have four left, and then to go to Dame from Acolyte, they need eight. So does this give four? This actually might be just perfectly too much. Yeah, I'll still do it. So I might miss one of the quests. Um, like I might go straight from Freeman to uh, Knight, but that's okay. And it, sh it crashed up here. This is a decent spot to defend. It's across a river. Um, it'd be much better if it crashed down here, but you can't really, can't really control that. 
So after a few hours, the raid will start. So I'm just letting my people do a little bit more work before, uh, before the raid starts. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and draft and drag though. Uh, undraft, cherry, quieter as well. My little construction robot and then everyone else. They'll probably stand out here and waste some time, but that's okay. Ooh, a fire. Uh, cherry, cherry and quieter will put that out, right? Stop what you're doing. Okay, he's putting out the fire. I wanted to make sure quieter could actually do it. There was a chance they were, um, you know, like a pyromaniac or something and I didn't remember. This is a pretty big raid. Um, the four cataphracts might might need some assistance. Sometimes you get this quest and then the four cataphracts or whatever they have, the Janissaries are enough to, to handle it. But it's with the, just the amount of people they have, it's possible that they're, they're going to overwhelm them. So I'll send in my, my melee people too. Um, I didn't want to have everyone go across there. So I'll actually re restart the, the, the shooting order. Okay, and then they're going to go in there. Elania will, will get closer to use her shotgun. Oh, Zoe, you have like a chain gun. Fire, fire your chain gun off, Zoe. Get to, get to work. What are you doing? They actually have a minigun and they're just wandering around. Coyote, uh, kill Buzz. Uh, melee attack Buzz. Onisan, Ishmael here. I Ismael? Kill, kill Ismael. Oh, Elenia took a shot. Um, Elenia, get out of combat. Go home. Oh, and they're all running? Okay, everyone go home. Everyone go home. I don't need to murder these people. I just needed them to stop me from getting murdered, so. Oh, no. Undraft go home and I'll steal all their meals and the uh, weapons if a if a cataphract were to have died I couldn't take their weapons they're they're bi-coded oh these are bi-coded as well it looks like oh no just that one um, but bi-coding means that it's like it's um, it's like a smart gun it, it connects to the the wielder and only the wielder can use it is Ishmael here Ishmael Ishmael is um not dead yet are they going to die yeah I don't think I'll be able to get to them and their stats are horrible, and they can't do dumb labor. This is like the worst person possible. They're greedy, they can't do dumb labor, and they have no stats. Um, so they get, they, they'll get they stay there. Critical fire. This is just the same fire as before. Why, is this not all my home zone? Yeah, this is all my home zone, so they, they'll get this taken care of. Melania took a shot, but they didn't they didn't get, actually lose anything. And Shield just went to sleep instead of tending to Elenia. I don't know why, but uh, rescue shuttle, jump to location. They'll get in it on their own, right? Yeah, Zena, get up and get in there. Zena's just uh self tending, I believe. Okay. Cool, so I got the quest done. And I can break the ship down. So I wanna look at my other quests, though I think yeah, Shield's Acolyte Ceremony is just gone. Like, it's simply, it's been removed from the game. So, um, I'll have to do Shield's, uh, Shield's Night Ceremony. So I missed the one, the one honor chance, but that's okay. And I want just some regular floors. What do I have enough stone of? I'm kind of running low on stone, too. Is this, is this bill suspended? Yeah, I'm going to unsuspend that so we get back to making stone. So I have... 400 granite blocks. I'll make the floor out of granite, and as mentioned, because I'm going to make this throne room for shield and this one for uh, coyote, I don't need to make it the nice floor. Coyote can deal with having lesser floors. Um, let me double check and see what coyote will need for their acolyte throne room. Two braziers, uh, tiled, no work. For okay, so just two braziers uh, and tiled, so that's totally fine. Uh, these are made of slate. Do I have enough slate to make two more slate ones? Yeah, I do. I do. So I'll just make. I'll just copy these, and then I will copy the throne here. And then when this is uh, when this is built, I'll be able to swap over the throne rooms and everything. And when Shield becomes a knight, he will have access to not just one uh, perk point essentially, but two. How Coyote can summon the soldiers down. Uh, Shield will be able to do that um, with both a greater. Not a greater uh, frequency, but with uh, with greater soldiers, where I might be able to do something else, like call down a you know a transport pod or something. I'll take soldiers for my first choice, but for the second one, I'll probably mix it up and not just take the the next set of soldiers. They might not even be available at the next choice. So either way, and we run out of power at night as before, but we're still we're keeping as long as the freezers stay frozen through the night. I'm kind of okay with you can just you know, have no power while your people are sleeping for a little while, and that's not that big of a deal. 
and we're recharging the batteries now. And research has been going really slow, um, just because it's such a big, the, the 3200 is like such a, a large amount of research um, to need to get done. That's okay, Coyote's there doing it now. Oh, and this is built, so let me look here, add build. Make basic subcore. Takes two components per, per each subcore, and does it take one subcore per robot? Um, yeah, it looks like it takes one subcore per robot. Agri hand. Do they just sow crops and stuff? Okay. Okay. Um, because I kind of, I could use it, a robot that's helping me chop wood. Oh, I've been a little behind on that. I don't know, though. Um, I think I actually want a military robot. I think we were talking about that before, um, a couple days ago. The militaries have, um, like little shotguns built in? So I'll make two basic subcores, and that's gonna be a fair bit of my components, but I'm, I'm okay with that. I've been wanting more robots for a while, and I was a little confused about how to do it, so... Coyote, why aren't you doing that? Are you, okay, they were they were just not pulled off the research yet. The, the game hadn't, like, checked to give them a new task for a moment, so... That's fine, they're doing it now. Tattered apparel, Elania. What are you wearing that's all tattered? Gas mask? We'll get rid of it. Okay, yeah, I don't want that. I don't care if you're wearing that. And they're consuming the insect jelly. As I said before, this stuff is like, it's really good. People love it. They get a mood buff for eating it. So I'm just letting them eat it while they have it. And this is so full of, of junk. Oh, all the bird skin too from, from the turkeys. I need to actually make another shelf. Um, I'll just build it over here. And then I'm going to do the same thing. I'm just going to have all my, my um, oh, I hit my table. Sorry. All my uh, textiles will go up there. So I made this basic subcore, and I had two. I was making two, I believe. Yeah, two is two of them were made. So bills, and I'll make two militaries, and that'll help with combat. My people won't die. And again, if the robots die, I, I, there's no real downside. They just come back. Shields finally getting some free time to chop his tree. Okay, we're getting there. Um, if Shield has time to chop his tree, let me see, quieter, are you, yeah, you're just chilling. You're going to plant, I'm going to get this second tree going. Um, and you can have them stacked up on each other like this. Like if you have um, two trees, because you, you don't want to build near the trees, so I tend to plant them all in one big pile if I have more than one. And you can get plenty of them. Uh, you can set the dryads to be the gow makers, and then these will make the seeds. You can simply just continue growing these. Um, you can have like an army of little dryads. And I don't think a dryad like costs very much, um, like in terms of your your wealth, like this 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 graph. Um, so I think they're actually really uh, efficient for defending your colony or doing stuff with because they don't add much to this graph. So the game won't send harder and harder enemies for having a huge number of dryads. Um, they'll send some, but just not a huge amount. Okay, so an eclipse is actually really bad. I want to toggle this automatic refuel and fill it up right away. With the eclipse going, I'm not going to generate enough energy to keep my colony going. So that's not great. But the, again, the geothermal power will save me from that. Nothing interacts with it. It, it simply provides the power it says it's going to provide forever. Um, oh, I didn't, no, no, cancel the connection. Um, I don't know who I was choosing. Yeah, I meant to choose Quieter. I just auto-started that. Okay. So now Quieter will do the same thing that Shield does and spend a lot of their time over here. But um, Quieter's cast is going to be carrier so they're just going to wander around um the carriers they're going to help me just like how all that wood was out here it's still out here geez um is this wood going to like get de deteriorated no nah, it's got enough time um the woods can stay outside for a long long time before it gets gets all banged up An inspired recruitment onisan okay so if i had a a, a a prisoner Onisan would be able to convince him to join my colony really quickly but I don't have one so okay so this throne room the throne rooms are done now so set owner this is shields and set owner this will be coyotes and they're okay with that so I'll do the quest now to make shield a knight except oh I need a harp uh oh well this doesn't have enough power but I can make a harp here yeah I can make a harp here and I, I don't want um coyote to make it I'd rather have, oh no, Veli died. So Coyote's back on, um, Coyote's back on craft duty. They're my craftsmen. Do I have someone who's doing this random stuff though? 
Yeah, it looks like Sky will do the um the the block cutting when they're when they're out of rather other tasks. So yeah, I, I can't make the harp for now. I just need more power. This eclipse sh it shouldn't last that long. It's been nine hours. It normally lasts for like a day. So I'll just I'll just be a little power poor for a day. But I'm, I, this one uh, freezer will help keep this cold, and uh, this one freezer the same will help keep this cold. So I have enough power to maintain my freezers. That's kind of all that matters. And some of the rooms are lit up still. It looks like maybe I got some more power just now. Both of these was both of these started going, and that was enough to generate something else. I'm not sure. And I could be min-maxing, like, because it's, uh, it's not super cold out right now. It's actually really hot. I could have these heaters turned off, um, but I'm not doing that. It's, it's not that much power. They, they don't drain very much power when they're, um, not under heavy use, so. And I do need to make a room. I don't know where Elenia has been sleeping. I'm pretty sure they've just been on the floor this whole time, just, like, passing out somewhere. So, my bad, Elenia. This, oh, this is Elenia's bedroom. Oh, you know what? Yeah, because Veli died. Um, so I actually don't need that room. I thought I needed it, but with the death of Veli, my colony's like the perfect size. I say the perfect size. I just mean um, I had enough rooms for all of my colonists without this bedroom. But this is a nice spare. Having a spare is fine. I didn't mean to make this. I made it out of silver? Oh, that's so bad. I made a dresser a dresser out of silver. That's like a couple episodes ago, like two streams ago or something. I was wondering where all my silver went. I was like, oh, I thought I had a couple hundred silver. Where'd it go? I made it into a dresser. Like, are you kidding me? Oh, that's so bad. That's embarrassingly bad. That's That sucks. Oh, and I need to set this correct, too. I made it and then didn't, didn't have it correct. So textiles only textiles so they'll take everything that's on there off and then put a, all my all my bird skin up there the eclipse is ending okay but it's nighttime so we'll wait till tomorrow and i'll have power and with the power i'll make the harp and then i will make night into a or excuse me shield into a night i almost said night into a shield So this could have this could have gone a little better. Didn't want to lose anyone today, but only losing one person, and it was to a disease. You know, my my doctors simply couldn't couldn't handle it. So that's not that big of a deal. I don't know if they can fit more stuff on this shelf, but it looks like it might already be full. So I'll just build I'll build a couple more shelves in there, and do the same thing, just textiles only. Oh, can't you like link them? Link settings. Link storage settings for multiple selected buildings so that they share storage settings. Do I need to like hover over both of them? I don't know how to link. Hmm. I must select two or more. I, I did though, and it won't let me link still. It's gone when I select two or more. I don't know. I'll, their settings aren't that complicated. I'm clearing all and typing textiles, so it's not that big of a deal. Um, I would like to figure out how to link these, though. I, th I think there's there's a step. Well, I know there's a way. I'm just failing to do it, so that's okay. And then all the textiles will go up here, and this the room will just be for my other stuff. Cherry just shoving everything up on the shelves. Let's go. Yeah, this room's not not nearly as cluttered anymore. And hopefully a trader will come by. And if they don't, then I'll just I'll just have to bear it. I'll have to bear the weight of all this random stuff I don't need. And do I is there actually a uh, an imp an imperial place nearby? No. If if this was closer, I could send shield and and send them off and trade. But there's no real no real places nearby to walk to to trade. Poor little Alina. Uh, Eustace is a, yo a yeoman of the Fallen Empire. He wants you to take care of his pet for 18 days. The pet can't do anything. Uh, two mech clusters will come attack me, though. So that's a no. That's a, a hard no. Those mech clusters will just demolish me. My people cannot handle that. Ooh, donkey one gave birth, so we got a little baby donkey. Um, and someone should slaughter this turkey. It's my last turkey. I don't know why it's not slaughtered. Do I not have my... Uh 
my auto slaughter set up correctly? Oh, yeah, no, no. I don't know why. That, that, that'll get taken care of. Someone will come by and take care of that. Maybe Veli was my animal handler and no one's handling? That's what it was. Veli, Veli was my only handler. This, this is making a robot. It needs a day and then the robot will be made. That's pretty cool. Okay, and here's the harp. Uh, Coyote's finally making the harp. Ooh, the donkey got pregnant so quickly after it had the baby. That's You love to see it. And as soon as this harp is done, I will be able to uh, turn shield into a, uh, a knight. And hopefully it'll be a nice mood bonus for everyone. Unlike the party, it should go well. So where where did you put the harp just now? Oh, right in front of me. Okay, I was like, it must be here. I saw them put it down. So as mentioned, as the... That kind of looks weird. I'll put it slightly farther down so it doesn't clip through. Because it looked like it was going to clip through the wall. I'll just put it... Whatever. That, it's, it's fine. Um, but yeah, as I as I make them higher and higher royal uh, royal levels, they will require more and more stuff. So this is this is not too much requirements. Eventually, their throne rooms are going to be very lavish, though. Um, if I want to continue up the the rank of royalty, but knight's pretty good. Having a knight is fine. And how far am I into this? Over two years. I didn't realize we had made it to the two year mark. So let's go. That's, that's a decent little time for a colony to be alive. We're, we're really getting there. The room impressiveness is decent. Yeah, and there's a fair amount of people here. So if this is good, I'll get a lot of honor. Um, not a lot, but a few extra points of honor. And you can use your honor to, uh, for instance, like here, these three points. If I had just one more point, I could spend it to, to call trooper squads before, before the time is over. Um, it does reset the time, though. So if you have a day till your trooper squad is ready to join and you spend honor on the trooper squad um, then it's going to be 45 days from then so you, if you can always wait and use it like summon them and then use the honor right after you've summoned them don't do it very late into the cooldown or it resets but if you have to you have to so it was honorable so we got two honor for the eight people being there and everyone gets a little mood buff and then shield has all of these things, but because shield isn't like a jerk, they're not ag abrasive, They're instead they're kind instead. Um, they don't actually require these things. They just say, hmm, yeah, I'd like to have them, but if you don't want to give them to me, it's not going to be a big mood debuff or anything. Um, they do need like the bedroom, but they're not going to require um, like really good food and stuff like that. So so that's good. Uh, I'll give them a double bed um, and that'll, that'll be good enough for a long time. So where's shield's room? Shield, do you not have a bedroom? What? Oh, it's just this bedroom. So I'll make this uh, shield's room, set owner, not Alania, and make it shield. And then I'll make this Alania's room. And that'll fix the problem. Undignified bedroom. Oh, it just needs to be slightly more impressive. Okay. This artwork, the baby doesn't need artwork. I'll give it to shield. And then the permits. These were the, the little points you get I was talking about earlier. And I got word of love. That's really good. I'll use this a lot um, on my colonists to help them uh, love each other. And then you essentially, every time you can, you want your colonists to be uh, in, a, in a relationship with another colonist. Or at least I'm of the opinion of that. So let me see. Shield. You're a male. You're 51. You're 57. Roughly the same age. There's no like family connection here. She, I don't think she'll just showed up. So word of love. And we can check the social. Do they like each other already? Mm. Where is she? Oh, shield. So not very much. They, they, they're actually, they like sky a lot. And sky likes them. Yeah. Sky, sky like super loves them. Okay. This is great. So it looks like maybe, maybe. Coyote broke up with Sky, and Sky would love to start the relationship again. So I'll have Shield make Coyote love Sky. Wait, is Sky in a relationship? Sky's in a relationship. That was almost really bad. Um, I'll have Coyote, because Coyote has a wife too. Now that I'm thinking about it. Um, what about you, Elania? But you're a lady. I don't think Coyote wants to be with you. Um, quieter, quieter. Fifty-six years old. Who do you have so interaction with? 
really has a huge, huge appreciation for Coyote, but Coyote does not love him. So I think I figured out who I'm going to force the love on. So shield, word of love, where's Coyote? I'm going to give it to Coyote, or I'm going to put it on Coyote for, for quieter. Well, where, where did Coyote go? Let me click on Coyote. Oh, they were just right in front of me and I couldn't see him. I'm so sorry about that. Coyote, psychic love for quieter. Okay. And then I'll keep doing this over time and people will continue to fall in love with each other. Why, why did I not do it? Because they're asleep? Okay, wait, wake up. Wake up. Both of you come over here. I don't know if both of them have to be awake, but uh, they are now. So psychic love for quieter. Okay, and then undraft them. And then with time, shield will uh, meditate and I'll, I'll do it again on um, on quieter for coyote, but I don't think I really need to. That being up to plus 100 is, is really like that's, they, they're already in love with coyote essentially. And Coyote's okay with with uh, with quieter now because of the the love. Oh, quieter's disfigured and physically unsightly. Is that because of the scars? Yeah, the scarification. Yeah. Okay. Um, Coyote doesn't like that that quieter scarred themselves up for their beliefs. But here's the permits I was talking about. I almost always take Trooper Squad. I think it's better than the other choices. Um, I could go Silver Drop just for money. Aerodrome Strike is really good. Transport Shuttle is really good. There's a lot of good stuff. I'll go for the Aerod Aerodrone Strike. So um, if, if, a, if an attack comes in, I can just have the, the Empire bomb them from space. Which, as one might imagine, is very useful. Having an Empire of... of you know, spaceships that'll bomb an enemy for you is, is great stuff. This will be done soon. And when it's done, all Coyote should run over and steal the mech out and put a new one in. And then we'll have two little soldier mechs. And this is, it's up to the stuff. Um, up to the percentage it needs to be. The dryads just take a long time to grow. So eventually I'll have my little carriers. Mad Panther. Is this another stockpile? Oh no, this is just, I thought this was a stockpile of bodies. It's just the, the leftover from the fight. Um, panther will come down and fight us. Yeah, no one's outside though, so I'm not, I think the panther will die in, in route to trying to make it to me. The traps and the, the turrets should take it out. Yeah, it's, 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 that's fine. <laughs> See, I don't like doing the proper, like, fully, perfectly efficient kill boxes, but I, I don't mind at all doing, um, like this, just a defensive area. Because this is kind of like a kill box. Just, um, if you're unfamiliar, a kill box is, a a very kind of weird setup you can do with doors, and you can make enemies run through, um, a long terrain where they, they can't attack you and you can attack them, or it can just be an area with a lot of turrets in it. Um, there's different ways to set it up, but I, I, don't, I don't like them. I think they take a little bit of the challenge out of the game. I think the devs added the uh, the enemies dropping right on top of you to combat using kill boxes. I know they added the spiders, be, or the, the giant, I, can't, I call them spiders, but the giant insects, because I think the initial strategy was to dig into the mountains really far, and it was really difficult to ever take out a base that was so deep, like deeply tucked into the mountains. Oh, I'm still on one speed. And I didn't note this psychic drone. We've had them before. My people are, all my females are a little less happy to be here. That's all. So Cherry, are you close to like a growth tier? They won't, they won't. I can't choose what to do with this till they're age seven, till they're seven years old. But I, I want to make sure they hit, you know, I would hope like two growth tiers. Um, that seems like a decent amount, maybe more. I assume if I had a better teacher, they would learn quicker. Just like real life, if you have a great teacher, you, you'll you'll do better with your learning. A pack of pack of what? Boom rats? No. And it's like a lot of them. Okay. Um, they're not gonna blow up this wall though. They're gonna do the same thing as everybody else and go through to this area. But I do wanna I do wanna go ahead and at least get my people with guns because I don't wanna melee the boom rats. Um, where's my little military? The little robot I just made. Oh, it's still in here. Get, get it, get it. Let's go. Um, and then shield ready up. Go over here. Who else has a gun? Sky, you have a gun. Uh, Elania, you have a shotgun. 
Uh, and then Coyote. Yeah, this little robot. It's a military. Equipped mini shotgun. That's really cool. Let's go. Um, so I'll actually, I'm going to just have Coyote drafted. Uh, I don't want Coyote drafted, but I want the little military to, uh, to to chase Coyote down. I want I want the military to fight, so I need Coyote there so I can actually like control it. Whoa, Onisan, get out of there. And then hopefully, yeah, they're going to start shooting. Okay, that was no big deal. I was I was maybe a little over prepared for that. I was worried that um all the the boom rats would make their way through, but I think they blew each other up mostly. So that's fine. That's fine. Ooh, and I'm so close to work drive. I need to try to remember to do that in what is it? 3 days? Oh no, it's in 4 hours that it'll be available. So I'll try to remember to do it. Um expand home zone. This little area is not part of my home zone. Oh, and the the, um, the psychic drone's done, so my people aren't sad anymore. I was a little worried that uh, my people would uh, have a mental break during the time they were sad, but they didn't. Work drive two hours left. I'm just leaving it on on Coyote here. Um, I want the work. I want to remember this. One hour left, so they'll they'll be they'll be ready to do that soon, and I'll probably put it on quieter, um, just to work on the fields and the wood chopping. Maybe shield. Shield's usually who I put it on. They do most of my stuff. I'll just give it to Shield. And then I will do a good wood chop inside my, my home area. It's been a long time since I've done this, so I'll actually be able to, to get a fair amount of, of wood that's grown. And we, Yeah, we picked up everything out here finally. How many components do we have? 20? That's fine. Slowly getting closer to the geothermal power. And I think the making the power plant here will take quite a few components itself. So I want to have as many as possible. Hey, welcome in, Snork. Hope you're doing well today. Hope you're doing well. You're a little early for the stone shard. We're still 20 minutes on the, the rim world, but... It's been a, a decent rim world day. Only only one person died, and they just died of a disease. So it wasn't, wasn't too graphic or anything. Chop to stump, get those done. Onisan, stop doing that. And you're converting a baby. Onisan just tried to influence a child to believe their beliefs. That's kind of messed up. But yeah, Shield's finally able to get back at working on this. And then Quieter does this uh, just as much as they need to, so that's great. That is how it works, yeah. <laughs> that, that's true, I guess. I, that when I said it, I was like, "How how dare you?" But then I was like, "Wait, that's what people do. That's that's totally normal." So we finally got some more robots. I'd been waiting to get more robots like the whole game, and it's just because I needed to make this this box. Oh, a concert! Let's go, Shield. Shield's just gonna pog off on the harp in here. Um, everyone's gonna hang out and have a good time. I guess everyone but quieter. He's too busy having his ritual prune, ritual pruning. He's not eating a prune, he's, he's doing pruning. Yeah, they seem, you can, you can hear the music if you zoom in. They seem to be having a good time. Ooh, I'll take the spaceship chunks, where are they? Oh, they're like right here too. That's actually great. Breakup, no, they didn't even have their marriage. Okay, so this bedroom that I said was not needed is needed. Um, Wooden bed, set owner, sky, rip. They, they must have had an argument. Yeah, yeah, if you don't convince everyone, they'll all, it'll just splinter off and have war. That's actually this colony. I have a lot of beliefs in it, um, like intentionally, because we're individualist, and there has been a little bit of a, not war, but there's been a little bit of struggle having the different beliefs next to each other. What is this? That's I can't pick up. Oh, it's the boom rat. And the rest of them are rotten. But this one I can eat. I can eat this one boom rat. And we still have so much turkey meat. 500 still. Flash storm? Where? Not on my people? Okay, I don't care. If it's up here, this is fine. This won't, this won't interact with me. The river is my saving grace. It protects me. I initially wanted to have a river on my, my chosen map to have uh, hydroelectric power, but... I ended up, you know, putting my building so far away from the river that it didn't it didn't matter much. Oh, 
We still have a good amount of the jelly too. I thought we would eat through this quicker. My people have showed some uh, showed some restraint with their jelly eating. Lots of wood. Yeah, we're finally good on the the wood. I should start up another steel mine order. We're getting a little low on the steel, and later on I'll need quite a bit of steel as as my my colony progresses further and further into a more technical, more technically advanced colony. I'll need a lot of steel. Um, I don't know how dangerous it is to be here, like on the irradiated ground. I'll just be, mine it out there. That, I don't know. If uh, if they get cancer, oh, that'll be a learning lesson. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, different beliefs often, often clash. Oh, I, I want to get rid of this stuff. I didn't realize this was just here. I don't know how I haven't seen it this whole time. I mean, I guess I've seen it. I just haven't actively noted it. Um, but I want to get rid of it just to create a more open space. And the Royal Tribute Collector, as I've noted every time they show up, I don't have any slaves or gold, and that's all they want. And this is another one of those uh, emergency quests. If the collect, if the Royal Tribute Collector is here, and then the, the, the shuttle crashes here, that'll be really good. The Tribute Collector will just do all the protecting for them. Four honor is plenty. I'll do it for four honor, and I'll do it with shield. Um, that won't be enough to make shield into uh, the next tier of upgrade. Oh, and this is a nice spot. There, that's a well-defended little area to crash into. It's not quite with these people, but it's still pretty well-defended. Um, so I'll have my uh, my people run out there just like last time. I'll wait a while first. It's, it's wasteful if you go straight away. The raid doesn't start for a while, so... Okay, I think I'm going to go ahead and do the draft. Draft them all, undraft the baby, and quieter, and then everyone else is going... Oh, and the, the constructoid robot. Everyone else is going with, though. I got everyone coming? Yeah, everyone's coming along. So let's see how big this raid is. It's just these people? Oh, this is fine. Last time this happened, they all had guns and stuff. This time, are they, like, naked? Do they even have clothes on? Why are they all naked? They must be nudists? But they're allowed to wear pants? What? Do they have pants on? No, I don't know why all of these people are naked. That's super weird. Um, I don't know if I've ever had that happen. Just a group of naked people attack me. Uh, so, yeah, I'll line these people up a little better. My shooters can tuck away behind a wall. And then these... I'm, I'm treating Elania as like a pseudo-melee character because of the shotgun's so close range. But th this will be no problem. Taking these people out will be quite easy. Um, if I shoot Skeleros here, the, the Empire will be mad at me, but the, I can't really, like, it's just RNG. Um, I can't, I can't not shoot them if they're in melee range like that sometimes. Ooh, and, and D D Doa. Oh, I thought Didoa was falling down. They were just standing on top of a dead body. Ooh, it looks like Onisan took, took some shots just now from that assault rifle. Um, or maybe it was Coyote? Hmm, maybe not. Okay. Shield can't physically see the enemies, so they're not shooting. Oh, Coyote, what happened? Okay, they're not, they're not like they're not dying though, so I'm gonna have uh, Onisan just rescue Coyote straight away. Rescue Coyote. Rescue Coyote. Onisan, no. We might have to do some triage out here. Shield, you should have medicine on on you though, right? Gear, yeah, three medicine. Okay, okay. So we'll be, we'll be able to make a triage center. Um, sleep, sleeping spot. Yeah, dinky dinky. Just make three and make them all medical. Okay. Okay, okay. Shield, shield. Ten rescue Onisan. Elenia, rescue Coyote. Rescue Coyote. Okay. No rescue. Even though you're afraid. Do the, do the command. Okay, okay. No risk. Bring them here. Bring them here. Uh, I'll just I'll just tend to Onisan here. And then, um... Alania. Tend, uh... You can't tend to, to Coyote? Rescue. I don't know why they're not going to these beds. They're medical. Um... Because how close is, is Coyote to, uh... 
Oh, pl okay. Place coyote in sleeping spot. This guy, stop shooting. Stop. Just, just leave it. Leave it alone. Uh, and Elania tend, tend to... Uh, already tending the coyote. Oh, they don't have medicine on them, though. Okay, so Onisan. Onisan, are you dead yet? Are you, like... Are you... Okay, you're, you're not going to die. So, um... So, shield... Shield, uh... Tend... Tend to Elania. Or tend to coyote. Because Onisan won't bleed out for a while. So, you rescue Onisan... Oh, sorry. I, I don't know how long ago you asked how I was doing. I've been just fully locked in the game, not looking at chat. I've been doing really well today. Very well. Thank you for asking. Hope you are doing well as well, Snork. Okay, Coyote, are you going to die? No, no, we're fine. We're fine. So I'll get rid of this, this, and um, this. And shield, shield, come rescue Coyote. Okay, okay. So that was that was a little rough. That was not the greatest... Um, Greatest. I thought it was going to be super easy, too. I even mentioned. I was like, oh, the last people had guns. These guys just have swords. It'll be no big deal. It was a big deal. That was a little rough. Um, oh, and they're using my Glitter World medicine. Stop doing that. Okay, so let me look here. There was no no, no trauma, though. No one got stabbed in the brain. Um, this Again, that, that, that scar is old. Ooh, lost a save on Stone Shard, where you are, were pretty lucky before that. I'm sorry to hear it. But it's not, you know, not that big of a deal. Not that big of a deal. Not not too rough losing a character in Stone Shard. You can always make a new one. It is a big deal. Well, I'm sorry then. I'm sorry if it's pretty rough for you. Hopefully you'll get a new character that's luckier. Oh, the character's not dead. Oh, okay. I see, I see. So just the save got rolled back prior to the item. That sucks. That's frustrating. Picking up a, a super juicy item and then and then having it roll back and not be in the chest the next time. Yeah, that can be really frustrating. At least the character's still there. Yeah, it's always an, it's very frustrating to lose the it was a five percent boss drop. Was it like a the the vampire staff? I'm tr I don't know what the boss drops are, like off the top of my head. I'm trying to think of them. Oh, yeah, the vampire staff. Yeah, that sucks. That's worth a lot of money. That can be quite expensive to sell. Or, I mean, there's probably a, you know, a niche scenario where you would just use it. Um, this guy is pretty sad. Yeah, oh, and the reputation, not even the money. That's true. It's a lot of reputation. I forgot about that. Um, I'm going to have my, my counselor, shield um, re, uh, counsel, Sky. Oh, Sky doesn't believe in my beliefs, so I can't do that. Okay, Sky's just going to be sad then. That's just how it's going to be. And Cherry's in a going to work really hard, which is, again, strange considering they're a baby. Sky, that's fine. Sky got dumped by his fiance. Uh, he can eat some food, food binge. Eat a tub of ice cream. There's no way to get rep higher. Uh, yeah, well, uh, you can sell them or, like, give them the, the, the occult gear, right, in Stone Shard? Like, if you give them the... The obsidian or whatever it's called, the black stone, you get a little reputation and stuff. So you just got to sell them the stuff they want. I think I could be wrong, but I think that's how you get your reputation up at the willow, at the rotten willow. Oh, those are all boss drops. Okay. Well, that sucks. You missed it then. Are you going to, are you trying to get all the way up at respected at the uh, rotten willow tavern or whatever it's called? You trying to max their reputation out? And all of these bodies I'll just leave out here. I want the food, though. I'll take the food. Oh, and I want my sword. Whoa, yeah, that sword. Just 500 for the trader. Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, you should still be able to get that with time. Um, hopefully, you'll find another item. Or, uh, I don't know if you know this. If you go back to the first town, Osbrook, you can... um. What is it? You can do quests in Osbrook and give them like the the phylacteries and stuff. The the Rotten Willow Inn will take your phylacteries for reputation. Um, and but you fail the quest. But if you you know at, at the high level you're at, yeah, it's a failed quest. Yeah, so that you you could do that if if you if you are okay failing the quests. But, you know, either way, 
if you don't want to fail the quests, then you could maybe find another item. They are pretty rare, so that, that sucks you lost the first one you found. Or maybe not the first one, but the, the one that you just found you lost. That, that sucks. But I think this is a pretty good, pretty good spot to to put a put a little cork in the rim world for the day. I kind of I was a little worried about the attack and everything, so uh, so I didn't want to deal with it then. But we've we've settled the attack. No one died. We're back to healed. We're in a, a nice nice fluid state again. I think this is a good good place to stop it. So I want to thank everyone who is here for the RimWorld for the day. You know it means a lot to me. If anyone's here enjoying the content, that's great. I love RimWorld. Happy to keep playing it. I hope y'all are happy to keep watching it. So I'm going to grab my lunch. Hey everyone, Quist Gaming here. If you're enjoying the content, please remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching, thanks for listening, and I'll see you next time.